I want you to be checking yourself even when you are at home for that all thing he has prayed for. And then I pray by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, every one of us will be the partaker of the blessing in Jesus' name. Uh, before we go, I want to tell us some things. Uh, I want us to keep praying for one another and let us be encouraging one another. When I say encouraging, you are begging people. You don't let them take you out. You know when somebody is inside the well, you want to bring him out. You be careful so that he doesn't pull you in. So let us do all we can do to be inviting others to bring them to the church. But not that uh, through our carelessness, they will take us away from the church. So God will help us in Jesus' name. I want us to have that uh, implantation. And God Almighty God is going to help us in Jesus' name. Pastor, that has sent message today that by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, in next week, we are going to have combined service. That's me. We're supposed to be in D.C. But because all of us cannot go to D.C., we will join them on Zoom. So whatever they are doing in D.C., we are going to be watching it there. We are going to join their sermon. Every one of us is supposed to be in D.C. But because all of us cannot go into D.C., because of our condition, we are going to join them on Zoom. So please invite other people. And then you will see how the Palabible Church of United States is. We are told us we are just, uh, 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 we are not minute, but we are member that because of the situation, we cannot be in D.C. But God will continue to help us in Jesus' name. Uh, we see the advertisement of the uh, shower of blessings. The one that is coming off from the 27th to uh, October 7th. Please, let us be prepared. Uh, we'll be sending them through our Zoom, I mean, through our messages to us on our cell phone. So immediately as I send them, please be prepared to join. And God is going to help us in Jesus' name. Monday Bible is tomorrow. Let's do all what we can do. I know for some of us, because of our work, because of our condition, it takes a lot of challenges. But if we can come, please let us come. I told us what is happening in this church is that when we have visitors, the members are not staying. And as a, as a result of that, it discourages the, uh, it discourages the, uh, the visitors. So that's why we need to be coming. Do not think of yourself alone. Think of how you are building the church. And the grace of the Lord will be sufficient for us in Jesus' name. Uh, then I will still give us a card. I don't mind if you put it at the door of your house. Give everybody to two. Or any visitor you meet. Or you meet somebody on the road, you know, just take. You, you have not used them. I don't say you should keep them. I say you should be using it to invite people. So you get a lot because you are not inviting people. So people who are coming to your shop, you get what I'm saying? Give it to them. When we go to, uh, what is this name? Club, give it to them. When you meet people on the road, give it to them that this is your church. You see to invite them. And you go, you, you, your own is just to give it to them. Forget the remaining. <laughs> and God is going to help us in this sort of thing. So those people, your, your managers, give it to them. Those people are coming to buy something, give it to them. That's what I want you to do. So you cannot tell me you, can, you are not meeting two people every week. So please do it, and God is going to help us in Jesus' name. If he's not, 
Put something on your door. When you want to enter your door, put something. Keep putting those cards there. Anybody that come and visit you, or when you are going, they will see it there. They will pick it. That's how to do evangelism. That's how to preach Jesus. By the time you are doing that, you are preaching Jesus. And God is going to help us in Jesus' name. Uh, okay. I think that's all words are, are for us. Let's open our book to Book of Psalm, chapter 4, verse 5. Book of Psalm. Chapter 4, verse 5. Offer the sacrifice of righteousness and put your trust in the Lord. Part of your sacrifice unto the Lord is your tithe, is your offering. You know when you go to the doctor, you pay the doctor money to take care of you. And you believe that whatever he write down is going to work for you. How big is your God? So if you give your God something, know that he is going to use it to take care of you. He give you that thing before you give it to him. You get what I'm saying? So we need to be having God in our mind. Anything we are doing. And I told us, uh, yes, I know our condition, but uh, you know, by the grace of the Lord, the church does not depend upon us. But whatever God, I need to be teaching you how to give. Whatever that comes to your hand, let's say you have $10, 1%, $1 of that $10 belong to God bring it to church. And that's if you have one million, one hundred thousand, by the grace of the Lord, you will have one million in Jesus' name. Praise, praise the Lord. Uh, I need to share one testimony to you. Uh, apart from the one, personal one, I shared the one of the church and then just, just reveal to me about about one month ago i can't remember about two months ago we are online and then pastor dada asked a question and they answer that question and he told me you are becoming a millionaire in jesus name uh i'm not proud i don't want to say this just for saint's sake and then that thing just occurred to me. And then by the grace of the Lord, uh, that was last, that was the day before yesterday, and my friend was calculating something for me. That was in Nigeria. I will become that millionaire in America too in the name of Jesus Christ. And by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, I eat that million. By the grace of the Lord. It, it, it just occurred to me now. It just occurred to me. So, uh, always give to Almighty God. And by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, God is going to give to you too in Jesus. So, and it's so your seriousness. It's so your, uh, how you love God. God will help us in Jesus' name. Let's bring our time to our offering. Let's raise our tithe and offering up. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus, let us stand up. In Jesus' name we pray. Our mighty Father, we glorify your name. We thank you, Lord, because of everything you are doing in our life. We thank you, Lord, because of what you still continue to do. Father, accept our thanks in Jesus' name. Father, out of what you have given to us, we bring this token, O oh Lord. Let it be acceptable before you in Jesus' name. We thank you, Lord, because of the two testimony we have had today. And all that even the church member cannot share, but you have done for them. We thank you, Lord, because of the message of today. Father, accept our thanks in Jesus' name. 
as we are ready to go, we are preparing for tomorrow Bible study. By the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, you are going to surprise us in Jesus' name. We are the we are the little of the Benjamin tribe. I pray by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, as you use the, 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 as you use many mighty uh, many mighty men to come out of Benjamin family. By the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, you will make us mighty in Jesus' name. Thank you, O oh Lord, because you are the Lord that answer prayer. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let's close our eyes. Let's close our eyes. Let's continue to put our offering into the bag. Do not forget, the first person must not know what you are putting into the offering bag. It is within you, an almighty God. And God that sees you in secret, we surely reward you openly in Jesus' name. Let's remain close. Let our eyes remain closed. But let's put our offering into the bag. When the offering bag comes into us, let's put our offering there. But remain, let your eyes remain closed. So that the, the, the right hand will not know what the left hand is doing. And let encourage, let's encourage ourselves to be bringing our tithe and offering to the house of the Lord. God will help us in Jesus' name. Do not say it's one one dollar. It's two two dollar. I'm going to be contributing. No. Whatever be the ten percent of your income, is your tithe. Is your tithe. Whatever you bring out of it is your offering. Almighty God is going to help us in Jesus' name. And they go to bless us more in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, we are planning to go back to the production of CD. Uh, God will help us continue to pray for me. For more energy, Almighty God is going to help me in Jesus' name. Let's share the grace together. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the day of our life, and we shall continue to go in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Thank you. God bless you. Uh, let us eat whatever we want to eat, and let's uh, take tutu soda. I can take care of that. I will take care of this to do that for everybody and let everybody eat whatever they want to eat. God will help us in Jesus' name. Uh, let us call, uh, uh, do not let us be deceived by our phone. Always off your phone. Always off your phone during the service. Please, if you think that you deceive us, no, we know. If you go and answer the phone call as if you went to, as if you go to bathroom, we know so please stop it stop it please god will help us in jesus name